Hey everyone, it's Doggyback2355, and today I am back with more Minecraft. I haven't done Minecraft in a really long time, and my AMCO videos I don't think I'm going to get anywhere with for a little while, so that might just be either put on hold or stopped altogether. Either way, not going to be up for a while. Today I have discovered this map, down, or I downloaded it, it's by a wonderful, wonderful architect named Lynch... I don't know how to pronounce his name, I think it's Lynchik. Hi, Mr. Peg. This map is going to be more than one part exploring this. I've already looked through this map already. I want to show it off to YouTube, and, you, and I had to actually fix one part. It was a massive chunk error I had to fix. Anyway, this map is purely amazing. I highly recommend it. Let's just take a look around. I actually kind of feel like I'm going to use this for a survival world, believe it or not. I don't want to take, I don't want to take any credit or anything, but I just freaking love this world, and I want to use it. Oh, and by the way, if you can't hear shit, I have something with my computer. I need some kind of freaking video card drive or something. I need Windows 7. need something like that. Can't fix a problem. Deal with it. So that's what little house was. Let's see. Scavenger Farm. I am in the... Oh, by the way, I'm in the realm of Vikdal. As a zombie chases Mr. Villager, this is a... This is a very, very interesting map. Let's head into the Market Square. This is supposed to be a multiplayer-esque map, hence the little signs where you can buy and sell stuff. Shut up, zombie. Oh, God, I hate when zombies break at doors. This goes... <laughs> and they kind of aim for them a lot. Let's check out Mr. Household Goods. Whoa, you guys are throwing a little party in here, aren't you? A little bat, you got a little, you got yourself a little bash going. More stuff to buy. Let's go up to tools. Ooh, I like this. I have put spawners on here, just kind of populate the area with uh, villagers and other animals and stuff like that. I would consider villagers animals, but they're too stupid to be considered them. I don't even think they qualify as intelligent life. Some swords and stuff, and just pop our way out of here. Oh, okay. I see what I did there. Aha, I see what I did there. Wool shop. Oh, hey guys, what you doing? Oh, I can't use that axe. I can't trade for a sword, I already have one. Take some redstone. Yeah, I just kind of stocked my inventory full of stuff to sell. Alright, head into here. You got more villagers throwing parties. Why wasn't I invited to any of these? Head outside. These are very nice houses. I just got a Skype message. I'll have to check that out. I hear a door opening too, which means that some my brother might come in soon. Go downstairs. Why is there grass in this house? Oh well. I had to question it. Anyway, I I love the detail. This is amazing. Anyway, let's keep looking around. I, I'm loving the market square. This is part of my. This is probably my favorite part of the town. You got yourself a nice little shop here. I like the tables they did with pistons. Oh, that's a cool idea for a stove. Get out of your villagers. You're annoying as hell. The fuck's going on here? Can I break it? Okay, that's really weird. That's even weirder. I, Minecraft's being a buggy fuck ever since it updated. Oh. This is like a little hotel, I think. Hmm. Interesting. I think it, this might also be uh, like half survival, half mod testing our worlds. I'm not gonna... I'm gonna do... I'm gonna do the nice thing, not take over houses, except uh, I'm gonna build a house somewhere and like a... Uh, not going to take any resources from the house, going to cut down trees, mine my own materials, going to do all that, and more weirdness from pistons, that's what MC Edit does to you. Can't find my way out of that place. This place just stretches on forever. I 
I really wish I had more people to play with, but unless there's someone in my house, my LAN server is not going to work. Unless I have Hamachi either, but my computer will never run that. Hey, where are you going? You going to go uh, have a party with your friends? Hmm? I think I've just about explored all there is to explore in this place. Can I go in here? Hmm. Anyway, I like the market square. This is really nice. I want to check out that airship. I know those little paths up there. Anyway, did I come from this way? Yes, I did. Let's see if I can find anything else. So this is the market square. It's very, very nice. I'm not going to go over every little house in the place because that just get boring. Fortunately, I think I don't have much of a choice. And floating tree, that's weird. Hmm. I've never been up here before. There's a villager where he shouldn't be. How'd you guys get up here? Why is my Minecraft freezing? Oh, hey, I remember. I was when I was stacking this place up with people. I put some animals around. Like Poppy, come on, Poppy, you follow me. Check what that Skype message was. No. Sorry about this. Back to the game. I will be doing more Slender in SCP, just that the new update's going to take some preparation because they did it now, they did Slender now so that your flashlight dies when the more you walk around. Something I'm not looking forward to. Spider? It's a spider. Okay, this is a little boring house. Too many cows. Get out of your cows. They're cows. Like, why are you doing your cows? Get out of your cows. Is there a swimming hole? Is this a town swimming hole? Looks like a swimming hole. Oh, very, very. Oh, wow. Very, very great attention to detail, and that looks interesting. These uh, walls are the edge of the village, so I might have to go back through the square. This is probably getting boring as hell. You know, I'm gonna, be, I'm gonna do a smart thing and switch to survival. Zero. Ha! Oh God! Get away from me! Why'd I do this? Ow! Villager, protect me. Wait, what am I... Yes, get him, doggy. Good boy. I'm going to name you... I'm going to name you Raul. You are my doggy, Raul. Come on, Raul. Let's go, Raul. Let's head over to some other areas, like... Shivagin Farms. I've already been to Shivagin Farms. Oh, a little fishing... I like the little duck. It's cute. Should I go to the military domain, or over what's that way? Oh, that's puppy sad. Come here, puppy. Yes, I have meat on me. I traded to, for the, I traded to some villagers. Should probably have to end this video soon. Let me... Come on, Raul. 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 Ooh. Lumberjack. Lumberhill militaries. I'm probably going to look through here and end it. Oh, very pretty. Very, very pretty. This is a nice little lumberjack hut. Except I keep finding open trap doors all over the place. I don't know if it's because of the villagers or what. Oh, wow. Like your little log set up here. I need to find a plot of land somewhere where I can build my house. This is a very neat design from the that these guys came up with for some of the paths. And I think I might end the video after exploring this place because it's uh, probably been about 10 minutes. Nice little uses for redstone torches. Are there, is there anything over here? Don't know what that's supposed to be. Raul, why are you all dark? Come on, Raul. Use the sign to check your balance. Search the shops to buy, sell, and make money. Because I'm up in a bank. 
Hello, Mr. Bankman. Oh, ironically, you're selling gold bars. In the roof party. You know what? I think I'm going to end this here with the retardedness of these villagers. This has probably been a very boring first video, but I'm going to try to explore this entire place. Not every single little building, but just enough so you can so you want to download the map. I highly recommend it. So we'll just go over to Planet Minecraft, look up Realm of Vikdal, and download this. I'll probably post a link. Bye.